Hey guys, it's Jim Halterman from TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider. I'm here with the lovely Lynn Whitfield from Greenleaf. How you doing, Lynn? I'm doing well, thank you. How are you? I'm doing very well. I know I'm biding my time until June 23rd because that's when Greenleaf is back. Yes, the it is. Fifth and final season. Um, what, did you know that going in? Like when you guys were shooting, did you kind of know that this would be the last season? We did. Okay. Yes, we did. We just, you know, that, that speaks to what a tight-knit family we are. <laughs> because none of us uh, revealed it anywhere. No. But we did know. So the stakes were high that um, these characters, these storylines, this story that people have come to really care about, that, you know, we really tracked and followed the truth of these, these people. Yeah, since day one, I know I followed it, and I I love where the journey goes. And I've seen a little bit of season five, but I know the season starts out with the Greenleaf family in a bad place as far as where Calvary's concerned and H and H, those dastardly guys over there. How's I love the that word, dastardly. Up? That's such a yeah. good word. How, yes, how's the family holding I up mean, at the start? Everybody, there's no more. Nobody's in the church. Everybody's at home. Yeah. So we are all in the mansion struggling with uh, the truth of our existence now and not knowing how, what to do. It's, 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 you've never seen such uncertainty because, you know, the green leaves, everybody's, just, it's a headstrong crew and everybody has an idea of how it, how it needs to be done. And, and for sure, speaking for Lady May, she is at a loss and seeking to hear God's voice because usually she's telling God what, how, you know, <laughs> praying to God for what she wants. But don't people do that often? Rather than saying, what is your will? We, you know, we pray, look, I need this, the car, the this, the that, the everything. And it's just a, 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 a very deep uncertainty and sadness and and everybody's been humbled a lot. I've seen a couple of the episodes, and I think all the all the viewers are going to be watching Lady May and Bishop James because they're circling each other again. Maybe fences have been mended. What can you? Where do we find them in the start of the season? Well, we, you know, they're trying. They're circling each other again. There's a, you know, you know, we saw in the last a flirtation of and him having to work hard to, you know, charm her back and court her back. But right now they are so distraught, troubled, lost, yeah. which happens because the, the, it's like the earth has been pulled from under them and they're not strutting down the halls of Calvary right now. They're kind of wandering around the halls of the mansion saying, what the hell is going on? <laughs> we, um, but yes, but I think in that state, they find solace in each other. Okay. You know, um, but the decision of whether or not they actually make it all the way back, they're really rest. She's really wrestling with it. Uh, wrestling with the idea of to, to really, really go back in as, you know, as women who are trying to seek their purpose. I mean, will I just become a support system? a bossy support system, but never realized my purpose. Yeah. And so it's a very interesting statement for, you know, a mature woman to be looking at, like, is this what I really want? Yeah. You know? And what's so interesting, everybody thought they knew what, how it should be, and it's nothing like anybody thought it would be. <laughs> so you see everybody scrambling to figure out what it's gonna be. Okay. I do like that she's making him work for it, though. Yes! <laughs> Absolutely! Yes. He just had that line, you know, you, you, I don't know. You'll have to come for me in ways I can't <laughs> even imagine. You sweep me off my feet. I don't know. I would expect but, nothing less from Lady <laughs> Mae. <laughs> That's awesome. I know I've asked you this before, and the fans, I think, will be disappointed if we don't see Ms. Oprah Winfrey one more time. What's your hope for seeing her again on the show? Because the characters of Mavis and May are just... Oh, oh. my God, they're so great together. My prayer always is that 
is that that Mavis is going to be there. So we just have to see, but because it's just such that dynamic of you know of how we played it, but the dynamic that happens in so many families, perhaps more dramatized in our show, but you know, a lack of forgiveness is really a hard thing. And I think that when people see it, uh, have seen and experienced the relationship, it's like, can you all just say it together or can you forgive each other? And how many families go through that? Yeah. How many families go through Lots. a lack of forgiveness? Yes. So again, it's one of those family truths. So I'm looking forward to it. I hope so. And I know there's also talk now of a spinoff. Um, there's not a lot of details out there yet. I'm just going to go out there and say that it should be called May with a big exclamation point. That's the, that's the title. Say it again. May. I'm putting it out in the universe. <laughs> Oprah, Craig Wright, listen to this. <laughs> Aw, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have had so much fun and so... Uh, like a challenge and hard work of an arc of this particular woman because um, we don't see a lot of the maze of the world. I, I remember I was at a conference and all uh, it was um, a conference of very powerful CEOs and all of that. And these women were like, oh my God, I want a selfie. I love Lady <laughs> Bay. She says, you will not get rid of me and I will be respected. And they're like doing all these models. I'm like, oh my God, can you just give me an endorsement from your company? You're so powerful. <laughs> they're like real big wigs, you know? I was like, my goodness, it has resonated with, with lots of different types of women. And, and that's an honor for me. It's a real blessing. Yeah, well, we'll keep an ear out for more news on the spinoff. We'll see what happens there. Yes. But June 23rd, 9, 8 Central on OWN, Greenleaf, the fifth and final season. Thank you so much for chatting with me, Lynn. Oh, thank you for supporting our show the whole time. Always. From the beginning. Yep. I appreciate yeah. you so much. You're very welcome. Social Thanks so much, Lynn. Kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much. <laughs> <laughs>